hi guys welcome back to another tutorial today i'm going to show you how you can create black and white half layer and the dodging and burning so first thing first we're gonna create a black and white half layer we go to the new action rename it black and white half layer we go to the black and white we slide the reds into the left so we see the details we slide the yellows too we go to curves, we create a curve into the shape of S, something like this. We lower the FST because I think it's too much. Make them a group, I name the group group of black and white out layer. And that's it. Click stop, we go here, let's check what we've done here. We click play and that's it. So another thing we do here is dodging and burning. So we go to new action, rename the action dodge and burn. We go to curves. First thing we create dodge, we slide the line up until we bite on the whole image. We click Ctrl I to make, to make the mask all black we name this touch we go to curves we slide the line down so we can create some burns it's ok control i to make the mask black we name this burn we make them a group we name again touch burn we click stop and that's it we go here let's see what we've done click play and have dodge and burn so what after we create the black and white half layer and dodge and burn we're gonna start working with dodge and burn so i'm just gonna click for black and white half layer also dodge and burn and start working with the dodge just gonna zoom in brush FST1, so maybe 15, move to 12 and start dodging some dark areas. As you can see, starting to work now. And I think our past of ours it's a bit lower, so we can go a bit higher. And we're just gonna start working, touching some parts. If, we, if you wanna see better details and not zooming in, zooming out, we have to go arrange, arrange new window for this picture, arrange into two vertical. We go to this one, let's make the screen a bit better. And we're just gonna zoom out this picture in the left so we don't have to zoom in zoom out every time we want to see what we've done here so let's start working let's touch on let's touch some areas as you can see guys what we're doing here you always you have to jump to the left to see better results as you can see I'm just dodging some black spots I'm just burning up a bit sometimes too much sometimes a bit I don't know Dodging and burning technique is a very very good technique to work with. So you don't have to destroy the whole picture. I mean like frequency separation and other techniques for smooth skin aren't that aren't that worse as people say but I think to, to 
combinate both of them, dungeon and burn with frequency separation, the results will be really really good. As you can see what we've done here. We just did some life parts. I think we're gonna need to work a bit more. So we don't have to be perfect because it's a star tutorial I'm just letting you know guys that what we've done here is black and white and just showing you what black and white whole player can do for your pictures because sometimes we see better details in black and white version which in color we can't see I mean like we can see both but in black and white version we see them better get some out just turn off this channel out here as you can see we have done some parts and i think it's a really really good job so another thing we do here is burn so let's burn some black and parts this, I think like this one, this one I think is too bright, and uh, this part is a bit bright, and this one too, so we have to work on both, not just on, on Dutch, so we don't have to create like a ridiculous picture we have to work in both of them as you can see the burn it's a really really good tool as you can see before and after and I think that's it for you guys uh, you can create your own black and white hell player also it doesn't burn action so you don't have to buy these actions from me or maybe from another person who sells them so we're gonna continue guys with this kind of tutorial so I'm going to show you every time and everything I use uh, for my personal retouch techniques so keep uh, subscribing me keep watching my tutorials and I'm going to show you every detail every tool everything i use for my own retouch techniques so keep following me guys and see you in next time